purpose of this program is to train you how to use the AAA template to enter your own frequencies and create your own custom programs. So we get calls on this many times. How do I write my own programs? I have a list of frequencies and I want to create something. So to find the AAA template program or AAA template, simply click Open Program. And you'll see it's pretty much at the top of the list. AAA template.frq will open that. And all your instructions are in here. So we're going to scroll down. The first set of instructions are for writing for the IM Pro Wave. And you'll see here it'll say duty 80 frequencies above 1 megahertz for IM Pro Wave only place below this line. And then it has other ranges to enter frequencies to run your IM Pro Wave. But as we scroll down a little farther, you notice it says here instructions below are for all bulb applications. Place your frequencies as instructed below for bulb usage. So this is where we're going to begin our training right here. So you notice here it says duty 30, frequencies between 11,000 Hz and 8,000 Hz placed below this line. So if you have a frequency within this range, for example, let's say 9,000 Hz, that would fall between 11,000 and 8,000. We'll click our mouse cursor here and we'll type in 9,000. If we had another frequency in that range, we simply click the comma, a space, and let's say we have 8,500. So we'll type that in. And let's say there's another frequency that we can put in here. And I'm putting in a comma and a space. And we'll type in the frequency, for example, 8,750. So all these three frequencies fall within this range. So let's say we have a frequency of 5,500. Where would we put it? 5,500 hertz. Well, notice here, duty 45, frequencies between 5,999 and 5,000 placed below this line. Click in my cursor, 5,500 falls in that range. If you have another frequency at range, once again, we hit the comma key, hit a space, and we'll put 5750 in here. All falls within that range. How about if you had a frequency of, say, 350? Where would that go? Well, as we look down, we see duty 35, frequencies between 499 and 300 placed below this line. Put in my cursor, type in 350. At this point, we want to save the program. So we're going to click File, Save As, and we'll save this as AAA Test right here. I'm going to save it as that. So I've named the program. If you want to, you can actually enter the time above here. Easy way to do that is just to click Run and see what your time is, or you can count the frequencies you've added. Each frequency will run for three minutes each by default. So how many do I have? One, two, three, four, five. There's six. Six frequencies at three minutes each is 18 minutes. Come back up here, click in my mouse, take out the X with a backspace. I can type in 18 for 18 minutes. Click File and Save and the program is ready to run. So hopefully this will help you to better understand how to write your own frequencies. Simply put in a cursor, put them between the lines or the frequency ranges that are discussed in each of these lines. For example, one more time, a frequency of 250 hertz, duty 30. You see the, the, the ranges here, and I would type in 250 here. So this is how you enter your own frequencies. I just added three minutes of that program, so I can change this to 21 minutes. Save it, and we're all done. So this is how you enter your own frequencies. Everything else is ready to go. Make sure you use a template. If you just simply enter frequencies without using these ranges, you will overheat your F122 and can blow fuses, overheat transistors, and internal components.